So, part 2 out of 5 of the master class job change quest requires 35 items for many boss in the Rigamore region. 13.3 only gives one item despite having three bosses. These items are bank shareable. This means that you can leave a stronger character on part 2 out of 5 to farm these items, then bank share them to your weaker characters. This will essentially that you skip part 2 out of 5 on weaker characters. You only can have a max of 35 items on a character at a time. Putting the items in your pet, etc. will not allow you to continue farming the items. They must be moved to the share bank, etc. after. So, the part 2 out of 5 materials, you can just put them in the share bank and then move them to your other characters as needed. Not all characters share the same materials. Ad and Eve share the same materials, Ayn and Noah share the same materials, and everyone else shares the same materials. This means that you need either an Eve or Ad to farm the 2 out of 5 materials for your Eves and Ads, etc. Obviously, you should choose a farm on the strongest character you have, but on the screen right now are my personal recommendations for who to consider for farming part 2 out of 5 items on. The items needed for part 4 out of 5 for the master class job change quest are also bank shareable. All characters share the same items, so you can leave a stronger character on part 4 out of 5 and farm the items for your weaker characters. You must farm the items in the master class dungeon that correspond with your character. For example, if you want to farm 4 out of 5 materials on a raven or elsword, you need to do 4 or 6. Because of this, I would highly not recommend you farm this on Rose or Rena because assuming you are running normal mode, 14.3 is by far the most time consuming normal mode master road dungeon. Also, I would caution against farming on Rabi or Ada unless you have good gear on them because 14.1 is a solo dungeon and that would eliminate your choice of asking friends to run with and or carry you. If you want to make masterclass farming more profitable, you would want to only do 5 runs a day for the Rigamore daily quest that gives 25 amethyst. In doing the daily Rigamore quest, you should also take care of the Rigamore weekly quest. Masterclass job change requires 50 Rigamore dungeons total, and if you do 5 runs a day, you should end up with 450 amethyst, which is enough to craft a Rigamore armor piece which you can sell. If you want to speed up the process, you can consider farming the daily quest on multiple characters. And finally, assuming the characters you are farming Masterclass on don't have an ERP page with ERP invested in EXP gain, item drop rate, and or ED gain, if possible, I would recommend trying to enter 13.5 to complete part 1 out of 5 and 2 out of 5 of the job change quest. There generally is at least one person who is carrying in queue, and 13.5 isn't affected by item drop rate and gives good drops even if you don't have any item drop rate on a character. This dungeon also gives good raw ED and EXP.